Hey there, Dr. Eric Klajinski, Fanwood Back Relief Center, offering convenient, affordable chiropractic care. We had a patient come in yesterday, I had a question about um, why they have neuropathic pain associated with their lower back pain. They find that some of their friends, family members, uh, when they do have lower back pain or neuropathic pain, they usually they have, they go hand in hand. Um, the reason being is we're gonna talk about some risk factors for both of these conditions. Um, number one, old age. Um, as we get older, our nerves uh, don't function the same. Um, so typically what happens is you will have some decreased degree of nerve function, which could lead to neuropathic pain. Number two, BMI or a body mass index. If you're overweight, um, it's going to place a lot of stress on those areas uh, and can cause both those conditions to occur. Uh, poor nutrition. Uh, if you're not getting the right nu nutrients, uh, your nerves need the proper nourishment in order to work properly. Okay. Um, another risk factor would be inactivity, not moving as much. You're not getting a circulation um, of blood and oxygen throughout the nerves, throughout the muscles to allow them to stay healthy and nourished. These are just some of the risk factors associated with that. Of course, there's other risk factors like medications, uh, previous spinal conditions, um, poor nutrition. Uh, all those things are, are really a, a huge factor in dealing with, both with neuropathic pain and lower back pain. When a patient comes into our office, we try to address both um, with a, in every way we can, whether it's nutritionally based, uh, the proper supplements the patient needs to take or the exact treatments that we need to do to get the patient, um, the, nerve, the nerve functioning better, uh, healthier, and more responsive. Uh, so that's all we got for today. If you have any questions regarding lower back pain or neuropathic pain or both, um, I'd be happy to answer whatever I can to the best of my ability. Um, hopefully you and your family are staying safe during this time. We are open today from nine to 12 and three to six. Uh, but please call ahead, and if you are feeling sick, I need to warn you, don't come in. Please, we appreciate that. Uh, have a great day, and we'll talk to you tomorrow.